this, this country is coming to. I just switched on the TV and I had to put on that dreadful channel, you know, the ABC, and they were spouting this terrible story tonight about our beloved Liberal government. It, it was just false news from all those lefties in the ABC. Then, then I got a terrible shock. It turned out to be true. Just when I thought it couldn't get any worse. It was like the whole country was about to burn down around us, with the country falling apart as well. As you know, we have a problem with not enough gas to export overseas, and coal-fired power failing. Uh, not building any, uh, any more, uh, you know, any more coal-fired power stations. You know, there won't be enough energy from coal and gas, and, and we'll have to pay more, or, or use that wind and solar stuff. And it's all a conspiracy by the lefties and the greenies. They're causing all of this. I know, I know. I know you think it couldn't get any worse. Well, think again. The Catholic right was running the country and we're right on track then. Now the situation, then the situation of this country started to fall apart. As Prime Minister after Prime Minister thrown out of office. Just when you believe it couldn't get any worse. The great Liberal Party, the great bastion of truth, justice and the Australian way is thrown out of its most prestigious seat. Has held since the creation of this beautiful country. That's right. Those born with a wooden golden spoon, a uh, golden spoon, born to rule, were thrown out of their great and glorious seat in Sydney, the seat of Prime Minister. It's totally and absolutely a disgrace. They're so lacking in gratitude. Now I hear the rumblings in the ranks of the country party. Looks like there will be a coup. Uh, well, what, what's wrong with them? We're here to hold their hand and give them a few offerings from our table. That's the trouble with the world today. Just no gratitude. God. Please, don't anyone light the blue touch paper. Oh, my God. We'll have a Labour government. And then where will we be? With the average working man getting free medical treatment? Oh. Energy they can afford? God help us! They, they might even want cheap education for their offspring. Be able to afford to send them to university. Oh dear God, they've got ideas above their place. And they'll be demanding we pay our fair share of taxes. Oh God, that's too much. No, that's, that's, that's too much. Uh, the country is going to rack and ruin. Uh, the shock of it all is too much to contemplate. Uh, uh, so I just turned on Netflix now. Uh, and then I'll get to some good episodes of Danton Abbey to restore my sanity and get some semblance of normality back into my life. Oh dear God, I ask you, sir, where will it end? This country is absolutely going to wreck and ruin.